You're right, Alan. Maybe I have gotten a little carried away with all this mother stuff. Maybe. I said that you are right. I do want to be there when Josh and Eva get their just desserts. I just have to arrange something for Tammy. That's look, all. Look, I've already arranged with Nettie. She's going to look after her. Nettie? Yes. <sighs> fine, fine. Nettie. <laughs> I'm just going to say goodbye to her, okay? Annie, you've already said goodbye to her. Alan, I told you that she is scared. She just needs a little reassurance. Just don't be long. <sighs> Sweetie, can I talk to you for a second? Over on the bed? You can bring her. <laughs> She's very cute. Here, big girl, you have fun up there. Forget the barrettes. No more barrettes. I'm going to have to leave for a little while, but Nettie, you know Nettie. She's going to take great care of you, and if you need anything, you just ask her, okay? Can I have Mommy's pin? The one with the face on it? No, honey. No, I can't do that. I can't let you have that. Please, if you give it to me, I won't be scared anymore. Here, here, sweetie. You hold on to this. Hold Annie, on to it. Really tight. Okay, Alan. Oh, okay. I'll be right there. Now. You be a good girl, and I'll be back as soon as I can. You listen to Nettie, okay? I love you. Hold on to that. Everything's gonna be okay. I'm waiting. Okay, Alan. Mommy. Oh, you're gonna go over and tell them that I'm supposed to sleep with Josh? You're gonna tell Lewis that I'm supposed to sleep? Why could you do that? Because I don't want you to. I don't want you to do this. And the Lewises don't deserve this. And I don't want to see you do anything more degrading. Okay? You've been through enough. I'm not gonna be able to talk you out of this. No. No, Cassie. I think we, we, we should go down there and we face these people and we tell them exactly what's going on here. And if you don't come with me, I'm going to have to go by myself. And I don't want to do that. But... I guess I don't have a choice. I just don't see where there are any choices. Okay, okay, what? Okay, um... I'll get dressed and I'll go with you. Good. Good. probably want some time alone before court, so we're going to go outside. Okay. 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 Thanks.
I've never been more proud of you than I met this moment. I just wish I could spare you what you have to face today. As long as you're by my side, I can face anything. So how you doing? You okay? Yeah, fine. Did you change your mind about testifying? I wish I could, but I don't want to do anything to have Roy's homeboys coming after you. Oh, I'll be okay, Jesse. Well, I won't argue with that. You're a lot tougher than you look. And you're a lot sweeter than you want people to think. You're the one that's beautiful in and out. <clears throat> Got a delivery here for an Abigail Bloom. Oh, yeah. Sure, I'll sign for it. Oh, right down at the bottom. Whoops. There you go. <laughs> here you go. All right. Thanks, Thanks a lot. It's a nice Enjoy. Thank you. Have you flowers? Yeah. They just got here. See if there's a card. I don't see a card. Rick! I wish I could take credit. I think it's an anonymous sign of support. Ah! Uh, it's good. See, it's good. you do have people yeah. rooting for you. What is this? Honey, this is a sick joke. Somebody's just trying to scare you. Well, it's not going to work. Nothing I say or do means anything to you. And coming on to my daughter and propositioning my wife, that's just payback. That's revenge, but I'm not going to take the bait. Brother Ben, your only opportunity to get me is in court. And once I beat the hell out of you in court, there's going to be nothing left of you or your reputation.